This is Earthly News Network with your out of this world anchor, Cosmo, and your reporter in the field, Joe. And now, here's Cosmo. Hello, friends. I'm Cosmo. Welcome to another edition of Earthly News Network, where we bring you all the latest news stories about the stuff happening on your planet called Earth. Today, our stupendous, magnificent reporter, Joe, is visiting a dragon. And I hear this dragon has a beard. Well, it's not a beard like you're thinking, Cosmo. This is Banjo, and she's a bearded dragon who's living in California. Her species is originally from Australia, which is over 7,000 miles away. Crikey! Her skin looks tough and bumpy. How does it feel? Her skin is tough, but it's quite soft to the touch. Bearded dragons are reptiles, and their bodies are covered in distinct plates called scales. Scales are made out of keratin, which is the same thing that human nails are made out of. If you look closely here, she has these spiky little scales. They're called lateral fringes. Lateral fringes have two purposes. One, to make them look intimidating, to scare off predators, and two, to help them with thermoregulation. What is thermoregulation? Thermoregulation is the ability for your body to maintain its internal temperature. Bearded dragons use their lateral fringes by expanding them, making them move really big, or contracting them, making them really small. Their lateral fringes help them cool off or warm up whenever the weather is too hot or too cold. <laughs> Cosmo, what are you doing? I'm flexing my literal fringes. How does it look? I think you're one step closer to achieving thermoregulation. But another important component is the Gular pouch. The Gular pouch runs across the chin and belly and also helps with thermoregulation by moving the blood closer or further away from the heart. That's some crazy stuff right there. Even crazier is that bearded dragons have three eyes. Two on the sides of their heads, one, two, and one on top, three. My grandma Astrid always told me she had eyes in the back of her head. Maybe she has three eyes too. This third eye acts like an infrared camera and can sense heat signatures. It can sense if a predator is overhead or if the sun is coming up or going down. Bearded dragons also have excellent night vision and can even detect ultraviolet light, which helps them hunt at night. Hey, who turned out the lights? They use their night vision and ultraviolet detection to help them find sources of food, like bugs. Yum! Bearded dragons don't just eat bugs, though. They also eat fruits and vegetables. Another fun fact is that bearded dragons don't make much noise since they don't have vocal cords. They usually communicate through body language, like arm waving and head bobbing. La 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 la! I'd love to sing! I couldn't survive without vocal cords! La 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 la! Well, I hope you had fun learning all about bearded dragons and their amazing ability to use different parts of their body for thermoregulation. Wow! Thank you, Joe, for all that wonderful information on the bearded dragon! And thank you for tuning in! I hope you had fun learning all about these three-eyed Australian reptiles called bearded dragons. See you next time at ENN. If you like this video and want to keep learning together, smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. See you real soon.